Calvin with Southern Country Living. And I'm Marie, and me and Calvin want to wish everyone a happy Mother's Day today, and I hope everyone uh, has a great day today, and I hope everyone uh, is celebrating it in the best way and safe way possible. Um, I have a really small family, but um, they're coming over. Some of them are coming over today, and um, so i uh, I got some really nice hanging baskets for my daughter-in-law, and also Calvin bought me a keg. He um, didn't make it, but he bought it. <laughs> but it was really pretty. But he is going to make me one for my birthday that's coming up. Oh, is that a challenge? <laughs> no, it's not a challenge. It's uh, you said you were going to make me that Coca-Cola cake. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, I'll make the Coca-Cola <laughs> cake. I've never made it before, but uh, if you'll show me the recipe, I'll make it. It's out of the same uh, cookbook that I made my coconut pineapple cake. And that particular cake was also an award-winning cake. And um, I tried to make it as close to it as I could, and I think it came, down, came out really uh, pretty good. Um, I'm not used to doing... Uh, cake decorating and so that was just the second time I'd ever worked with piping and so um, for it to be my second try I think it turned out pretty good. It turned out great and I loved how it tasted. Uh, it was real good cake and the next day after it had been refrigerated and got cold it was even better. Yeah. So I really enjoyed it. Okay uh, let me give everyone an update on the little baby that I told you about last week. Uh, her name is Kinsley, and she was born, she only weighed a pound and 14 ounces. So uh, she's a one week and one day old today, and she's still doing good. She's in the preemie ICU, and the doctors say her weight has been up and down just a little bit, but she's still doing good, and they are posting some pictures on Facebook, but I'm not going to share any of those pictures on uh, YouTube right now. Uh, when the baby gets bigger and the mom uh, gives me permission, I'll do it then. But I hadn't even asked for permission to share it because I felt like that's more private for her. But uh, I'll sort of keep you updated as, you know, as time goes on with the little baby, Kinsley. And we do appreciate everyone praying for yeah. that. So prayers always work and they help. Okay, Marie, we did a bunch of videos last week. Yeah. And... Uh, the biggest thing I want to talk about, though, was the weather. Oh, really? <laughs> you want to talk about the weather? I thought that was my job. <laughs> the, uh, on Tuesday, Marie was doing one of her videos, and it kept lightning. And I have several scenes where it was lightning and Marie would jump, but I edited all that out. Uh, <laughs> this, was a, this was a very good video that she did. Uh, it was when she did the... Uh, coconut pineapple cake. Now, and, I didn't jump that much. But but anyway, <laughs> I edited it out because I didn't want to have bloopers at the end of that one. <laughs> but uh, that storm was so bad around, I think it was 10 or 11 in the morning, the wind was blowing so hard, I just knew we were going to have some trees come down. And we did have trees around the area that came down, but yeah. none for here. But it blew all my pepper plants over. Yeah, and what was so amazing, I had just looked out at the garden and I said, that garden is really doing good. And <laughs> it really looks good. And about 10 minutes later, I looked up there and I said, oh no. I know. And it was just, it was just beating my plants to death. Yeah. And so my tomatoes plants look terrible. But I've worked on them. I went there and stood all the pepper plants back up and tried to tie my tomato plants up best I could. We'll just have to give it a few days and see how things work out. <laughs> but, uh, okay, Marie, for our videos that we did last week, uh, the first video we did was Sunday Chat. Yeah. And we did that video over there at your workstation, mm -hmm. and I was just testing some of the settings on the camera, uh, trying to get it to do a little better. There's a couple of things that I noticed that I was trying to improve on. Now, I think I've got it doing better. Uh, we'll just have to do it a few days and we'll see over time how that works out for us. But I hope y'all watched our last week's Sunday chat and we appreciate you watching this week's Sunday chat. Uh, first cooking video you did, Marie, 
was, in my opinion, one of the best tasting casseroles that you've made in a long time. And that was the chicken Mexicani casserole. Yeah, it was really good. And quite surprisingly to me, those uh, chips in it did uh -huh. not get soggy. They didn't. Uh -huh. And I, I love that taste of the uh, nacho tortilla, tortilla chips. <laughs> yeah. And uh, they were really, really good. Just gave a good crunch to it. Yeah. Uh, next video Marie did was the coconut pineapple cake. And that cake was very delicious. It was made from scratch, and Marie won't say this, but uh, she don't like to take credit for doing anything good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but she worked very hard making that cake. Uh, there were several steps to it, and when she got finished, I was very proud of the cake. I thought it looked great. And she was trying to make the cake look just like the picture on the book. I was, and I think I didn't you did a think, good job. I didn't think that I could make it look just like that, but I was trying to get as close as I could. And you did it too, Maria. It looked great. I was real proud of you. Thank you. And like you said, that was only the second time she's tried to do piping uh, on a cake decorating. Yeah. And so I told her, I said, well, just find another recipe that you like and practice some more. I'll help you eat that cake. <laughs> well, I'm not a professional cake decorator. I like to make cakes, but I'm not a professional cake well, decorator. <laughs> well, um, you know, we're just we're just average everyday people living out here in the country, and uh, I enjoy what you do, Marie. You do a great job. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, now you guys say the same thing about me when I make a cake for your birthday. Well, I don't think you're going to decorate it, but I'll give you the piping. Um, no, no, no. No piping on this cake. This is, <laughs> no piping on this cake. Her birthday cake would just be a basic cake. <laughs> okay. The next recipe you did, Marie, was the chicken taco soup. I love that. And taco soup is something we've been doing forever. Yeah, but we usually use the beef in it, and uh -huh. this was really good. Uh, our, uh, our daughter actually told us about this recipe. Yeah. And it was, uh, she had got it from one of her friends that does the Weight Watcher program. And to me, it had just the right amount of heat in it, not too hot and not, you know, wasn't all, it was a little spicy, but not, not overly spicy. Yeah, Marie made it the mild way. Yeah. If you want it to be hot, you'd need to put the hot seasonings in it. And that was how my, uh, or that was how our daughter made it. Yeah. She made it with the hot seasoning. And she said they really enjoyed it that way. But Marie and I, we can't eat anything's too hot and spicy. It's got to be mild for <laughs> us. But that was a, that was a feist and easy one pot meal. Yeah, and I just love crock pot meals, especially if you got an errand or something you got to do that day. You just come in uh, in the evening and there you got your uh, meal. And so that was really nice. <laughs> it was. What we need to do, Marie, next time you do a, a crock pot meal, and when we're going to go off and be gone most of the day, we need to take our camera with us and just do a little video on it. And what's that called, blogging? Well, we've done some of that. We went lot, lots of times when I go to the Dollar Tree or different uh -huh. places that I have to go to. Uh -huh. We've done some of that. Yeah. Well, we need to do that again next time you <laughs> go to the Dollar Tree and uh, and uh, put that up for a video. Okay. How's that sound? That sounds good. <laughs> okay. Well, that's probably all we're going to talk about this morning. I uh, just wanted to wish everyone a happy Mother's Day. Uh, and like I said, I hope you're having a great day today, and I hope everyone's getting to be around their family, and uh, everyone stays safe in the process of being with your family members. Yeah. And so, um, I just want to express what Kevin said, and uh, I'm glad that my kids are going to come around <laughs> today, but uh, like I said, we have a small family, and if everybody gets together it probably will be less than 10. Yeah. yeah. Okay, well everyone have a great day and we'll see you on our next video. And do what you love and love what you do and like Kevin said, see you on the next video. 
Bye. And y'all have a wonderful Mother's Day. Like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here